we're trying to do is innovate the way that brands are built, which is really built on this revolution of technology and how it's changed people's behavior. You can't help yourself but saying, wow, because the new technologies, they're emotional. You know, they create an emotional response from you. The predominant theme of CES this year is definitely a combination of voice and AI. Where we're going with voice being a new interface with many, many devices, how we uh, begin to transact, engage with new information, communicate, and so forth. I'm always a big fan of the startups because I think they do the most interesting things. I'm less concerned about what's the next version of the driverless car, or what's the next version of connected devices. It's more who's doing things that are really changing the game. I really hope to have a better sense of what the media owners can bring regarding data to see how we can enhance our partnership and how we can bring new solutions to our clients. What's great about CES is it's uh, obviously it's the start of the year. This is a great opportunity to set the agenda for the next 12 months. So we actually have a Dental Aegis Clubhouse. We're at the forefront of what's going on in, in this innovative space and that we're thinking about technology when we're addressing some of our client challenges which are going to be solved by technology. For an event like this, if you're not here as an agency that is the leading edge of innovation and change, then you're going to be looked over by other agencies that are making that play. What I'm really interested in seeing is when a solution has picked up on a consumer pain point and has magnified that and has solved it in a new way. That is important to us and we take that back to our own business and we derive from that consumer trends and attitudes among consumers that we can speak to with the work that we do. CES, what you have to do is you really have to separate the trivial from the quite important. What we've done is actually take the kind of information that you see here, that you get in Davos, that you get in Cannes, you get in a number of uh, these big shows around the world and integrate them into a clear strategy. Actually condensing that down into that single vision of a 100% digital economy business by 2020. We siphon all the information we get here, we put it through our strategy process, spreading out entirely through the organisation.